what's on your grocery list. You may want to double check some of the items you added on your list. Products that are high in fats, salt, and sugars, even when in small quantities, can compromise your diet and be extremely harmful to your health. The PAHO Nutrient Profile Model provides a tool for governments to identify unhealthy products and use public policies to discourage their consumption. Imagine, it's time to get your groceries. You start by adding foods that are essential to your daily diet. The overall amount of free sugars should not exceed 10% of daily calories. But let's say you add a ultra-processed or processed product that, according to the PAHO Nutrient Profile model, is high in sugars. Now, the total amount of sugars will be above the recommended daily intake. And this amount will continue to increase as you add more products that are high in sugars. The PAHO Nutrient Profile model defines when products are high in sugars, fats, saturated fats, trans fats, and sodium. The PAHO Nutrient Profile model is based on the WHO Population Nutrient Intake Goals, which are adjusted according to the energy requirement, not a fixed amount per day. Different age groups have different energy requirements. The PAHO Nutrient Profile model accounts for diets that are balanced for all age groups. Diets free from ultra-processed and processed products high in sugars, fats, saturated fats, trans fats, and sodium are key for a healthier region of the Americas. Learn more about the Nutrient Profile model at PAHO's website.